up the world? It is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here, hanging out today, doing stuff and things with my shirt off. Tana is a chiseled man. Tana has a chiseled chest area place. Look at those abs. Tana do all the exercises. Can you imagine? I feel like I would bulk down. <laughs> Hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a really good day. Just hanging out, getting some metal stuff and things done. I've been doing a ton of stuff, guys. A super amazing ton of stuff. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to tell you guys all about it. But I wanted to start off by saying, as I always do, thank you guys so much for all your support in the ARC videos. Continues to be an amazing experience. It's all because of you guys. If you like the video, please don't forget to smash the like button. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe for more daily ARC stuff and things. That's my dance. All right, so we broke our armor, okay? This armor is broken. Some stuff and things have happened, and we got to fix it. So we need a fabricator. So I decided we got to get one going over here. Wait, where are we? Structures, crafting, we got all the things we need. 35 metal, 20 cement paste, 50 spark powder, 15 crystal, 10 oil. Nail the days to can't be stopped. Craft the item, do it right now, amazing. Let's make a fabricator. Also, in the time that we have been away, I crafted up some simple rifle ammo. Got a little bit of that stuff and things going on. Bam! Nail the days to can't be stopped, we got a fabricator. We got the rifle ammo. Ammo. Oh. I killed a alpha raptor. And got a journeyman metal pick, which is better than the one we had before. It was an apprentice, and now we have a journeyman. So, pretty baller stuff and things there. I got some metal crafting up inside of here. I got some metal in the forge, doing its stuff and things. So, we're getting all that done. Now, let me show you the update of the metal. That is an RG that's dead. Let me show you some of the updates of the stuff and things. What do we got going on over here now? This is the oil we had. I used some of that to make gas. Where did I stick my gas? Here you go, man. We got all the gas. We got a lot of gas now, uh, a lot of beans we've been eating. And then, oh, all right, over here, check it out. We've got one, two, how many? One, two, three, four, five, six thousand, almost seven thousand metal. Six thousand eight hundred and eighty-six metal, I think, is what we got there. So we got huge, huge amounts of metal. Now we've got to place our fabricator somewhere, and it's going to be temporary type deal. So I'm thinking, should we place it? Right over here, on top of immobility? We might as well, right? I don't know. It's just going to be for now, Z's. It's not going to be forever, Z's. We really don't have a lot of room to stick it on hardware. Um, we could just put it down on the ground over here somewhere. But I think it'd be better. We might as well just place it on mobility, and then that way we'll have it on mobility all the time. Um, all right, so let's land. And let's take a look. On the upper level here or on the lower level? Let us... Okay, took a second. For them to fix that, for them to, for me to get off of there. Also, they did no, get me back on there. They did fix it now, so um, you can get on ladders and off of ladders and stuff and things on um on the dinos, which before was bugged. I think when two one seven dropped, two one six or two one seven, that went ahead and bugged out on us, and we couldn't get up and down ladders, or we couldn't get down a ladder at least. So um, they went ahead and fixed that. Now, all right, we gotta figure out a spot for this. We could put it right here, How, or maybe right over here. Does it? Do we have room? Look at that. Would that be good? Or should we put it on the upper level? Um, I kind of want it down here just so that it's close to these chests in case we want to put anything in here for storage. So for now, Z's, I think we will squirt it right down right here. Uh, let's go into the K menu. And I just want to see if I can see. No, that looks really good. Um, let's turn it just slightly. Uh, uh. Oh, wow. We can just place it like this? No, we're not going to do that. All right. Let's see if we can get it here. Really nice and lined up. Nailed it. It can't be stopped. We've got our fabricator stuff and things. All right. So we're going to squirt this in there, squirt that in there. We need metal, hide, and fiber in order to get this stuff repaired. So let's go ahead and grab that stuff up real quick while we talk. So I was thinking today we might need a to-do list. We did this in, in Feed the Beast in Minecraft a while ago. We did a Toto list. And a, a Toto list is a list of all the stuff and things that we need to do. Is that a person? Do you see that? I thought I saw a person over there. So, uh, 59. There we go. We got that stuff. We got the metal and we got to grab, what was it? Hide and fiber? So let's head over here and grab those. But yeah, a to-do list to kind of like get an idea of, of what we got to, what we want to get accomplished. You know what I mean? Um, I want to, there's specific dinos that I want to get tamed up. Um, I want a Dodic. I want an Anki. Um... I actually do want to make another foraging area, um, even though this is a really great spot over here. I think we have the potential to get a lot more metal. Um, up on the mountain that's right there in front of us, there's a huge amount. And I think I'm going to bring you over and show you guys that stuff as soon as we get repaired here. 
Um, but I'm thinking about doing a mobile forge, or not a mobile forge, but a forge up in that area too. So, all right. Oh crap, you know what we didn't grab? Gas. So, do we have all the stuff and things we need now? All right, we do, but we just need the gasoline. So, um, the to-do list is a thing, and I think it's gonna be helpful. I think we're gonna use like one of the big billboards to write it out, and uh, we'll put it in the base here somewhere. Um, we've got to get some basic steps going so that, you know, in the future, we'll have all the stuff and things we need. We'll put, go ahead and grab 100 gas. I went out last night, and I was looking around. That was when I fought the raptor. Um, I found, I was looking for basically high level RG to pump um, a second Argentavis for weight. Um, I'm looking for an Anki, a Dodic, so yeah, those sorts of things. Um, and then, see, this is going to be a problem. Wait, we got it. No, we got it, I said. Can we go like this now? Nailed it! Alright, so, um, yeah, I want to get organized that way. So let's go ahead and turn this guy on. Repair this item, repair this item. Nail the days to camp and stop. We got some armor back. Oh, yeah. Ah, feels good. Feels good to be alive today. All right, so we got that going on. We're good to go there. Other than that, not much has changed in and about the area. For anybody who happens to have missed the last episode, I do want to tell you guys, I did use a mind wipe tonic, and I did change some of my stats around. So you can see now we've got 200 health, 200 stamina, oxygen, food, water are the same. 350 weight, 120 melee damage, and that's really what I lowered. Um, we got 128% movement speed. I did pump fortitude to 20%, and I do have my crafting speed turned up to 150 now. So we're going with before, basically, if you didn't know, we had a lot more um, we had a lot more melee damage. And it feels like on a PvE server, I thought, like, I didn't really know a lot about how that was going to work when we first started. I thought it would just be cool and fun. And it seemed to be a little bit of a waste of a statistic. It's not really helping us out that much. So, all right. Now, the next thing, I think we are going to go ahead and take a look at getting that wooden billboard made. I'm going to go ahead and get the, the, the billboard up, the Toto list, ready to rock. So you can see all the stuff and things. And then I will BRBs, peeps. And we're back! <clears throat> and we're back, ladies and gentle peeps. My ladder works! I'm so amazed! We're just doing some stuff and things over here. Just doing a little bit of organization. This is how we do, man. This is how we do. We're doing it uh, like a so. But I've made the to-do list. Some people call it a toto list. I call it a to-do list. Here it is. Let me show you. Here's our to-do list. One, make a to-do list. We did that. Two, accomplish the first item on the to-do list. We did that! This is amazing. We've already done two of the things on our to-do list. It's unbelievable. To-do list item number three, get an Anki for metal. All right, that's that's more of a long-term goal. Four, get a Dodic for stone. Five, Argies for weight. Probably two or three high-level Argies. Six, Mountain Forge. Probably want our Argies ahead of time before we start to build our Mountain Forge. So we can move stuff and things through, through to and fro. Seven base building supplies because we need to start getting some stuff and things ready for our base. And seven point five inside of base building supplies is elevators. So yeah. Anyway, first things first. I'm feeling pretty excited about this to do list. I'm just telling you right now, guys. We've already got a couple items crossed off of it. It's really working out great. I think we need to do a revision now just because we've got a couple of items on here that we've already accomplished. And uh, just take a minute to think about if there's anything else that we want to put on here. And we're back. Having crossed off the first and second items on the list, I have redesigned the list. Now it reads 1 Anki for metal, 2 Dodo for stone, 3 RGs for weight, 4 Mountain Forge, 5 Base Building Supplies, 5 Bot 5 Elevators, 6 Put six put Vanilla Pudding and Mayonnaise Jar Eaten Public. Something I've always wanted to do. And I just thought that that would be something that we should add on there. Just because it doesn't have to always just be about accomplishing goals. I mean, well, honestly, that is a goal. That's like a goal, life goal, and a life lesson, all wrapped into one little package. So um, what I thought we would do next is take a trip up. Where's gameplay? We take a trip up to the area that I want to show you where I think we're going to build a mountain base. Oh, over here, just so you know, I've just been burning up some wood to make um, charcoal with because I needed gunpowder for the simple rifle ammo. So just been doing that over here. Also, I got a bunch of stone, and for my trip to the Chitin Cave, We've got all the cementing paste, too, which we're going to be able to start to turn into building supply stuff and things. So, all right. What I'm going to do now, I think it's just in the early morn, but I'm going to head to the top of this mountain so we can show you guys kind of where and have a look together at the mountain base stuff and things. Kind of see where we're going to start building. 
And we're back. Small detour. Before we go, level 28 male raptor, alpha raptor. I'm thinking we can probably just take him. Let's get out some of his minions here. We don't want him to be mate boosted or anything of the sort. Are you just going to eat your brother, your girlfriend, or whatever it was? You guys are disgusting. Disgusting pigs. No, 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 no. No, no. No, you don't get to do that to me. Hold on. I'm going to pick your buddy up and go for a ride. That's what's up. 104. This guy's got some baller buddies hanging out with him. All right. So let's see here. We're going to do some like different swipey passes here. It looks like we're holding up pretty good. We got to get an angle on him. That morning sun, man. That's the thing. Oh, he's got another buddy. We're doing pretty good. Health is not that big of a deal. Oh, yeah, baby. Nail the days to can't be stopped. We don't have anything to cook up all the prime meat with, unfortunately. We're just going to grab it for now, Zs. We just don't have the industrial grill yet. Oh, we got to put that on our list. We got to put that on our list. What level are you, homie? 20? It's not even a mouse on a wheel. All right, let's check and see what kind of armor and stuff and things we got. Primitive cloth crap. Primitive slingshot, blah. Primitive what? No. No, this is not the good stuff. No, crap. Primitive metal pick, garbage. Apprentice metal pick, not bad. Apprentice hide pants. A couple of recipes, and I think that that's it. I'm saving some of the arrows. We're a little bit low. All the rest of the stuff, well, I guess we'll just drop. Like a so. But that's pretty unbelievable if you think about it, guys. Like, we... Look at all that prime meat. We're just throwing it all away. We need it. Oh, no, 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 Oh, crap, and it's nighttime. We got a gamma up. What did I even just drop inside this huge pile of crapo that's going to be on the ground right here? Oh, where did it go? Oh, here it is. No! What, what did we drop? Uh, I think it was just arrows and a paintbrush. So, anyway... Um, we got to put the industrial girl on the Toto list. Where are... There's our paintbrush. And then can we just luckily, super luckily... Look at all this stupid, crazy amount of stuff. Like, oh, there's the arrows right there. All right, sweet. So we got all that stuff. Um, we'll drop these back inside of here. Get a little bit organized. And then like so. All right. So right up here, I guess I'll just take you straight up so you can see what I'm talking about as far as the mobile forge. So the metal that's back at base... It's on that mountain directly behind us. Is a good amount. I get about one, two, three, four, five, six, maybe seven hundred, or so, like three hundred and fifty metal um, per trip over there. But when you come up to the top of here, guys, this is where the action is, man. There's crystal, there's obsidian, and there's metal. Look at this for days. These are all the very high advanced, like the the most densely packed metal nodes. Um, I'm not sure about how an Anki would do up here. Um, as far as if they could walk up the grade or not, but it doesn't even matter. Like, if you could even just have your you and your pick, man, the amount of metal you get here per trip is redonkulously huge. Now, over here in this area right here, there's nothing that spawns right here. Um, so, might be a decent spot to build that. But look, over here, there's more metal. There's more metal. This is a kind of a neat spot, possibly right here, that's nice and flat as well. There's not as much metal in this area. All the way down the mountain here, too, though, as we come down in this area, look at this, guys. Just metal for days. Like, everywhere. Way, way more than we have at the base. What level are you? We are on the hunt for RGs. It's on our to-do list. 16! I've been going back and forth. Free water. I've been going back and forth in this area for a couple of days now looking for high-level RGs. Oh, no! XB got killed. I think XB and Z are out doing stuff and things. But I've been on the search for a high-level RG for a couple of days, and I've yet to see anything over 100. There's another guy right there. What love are you, big guy? You're way up in the air. 24! So I think XP's okay. He's probably got Zul'jin with him to help him out. But um, yeah, any who's I figured I'd show you guys this. Also, it's really dark right now. Oh, is it night raining? Night rain. It's like night moves, but night rain. Ah, oh, see the metal. It's so um, unbelievable. Um, just a crazy amount of it. I'm thinking we could build the, the mobile. Oh, 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 I'm, I'm cold. I'm dying. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, oh, wait, I have my stuff. Hold on, hold on. If we just put a hat on. Uh, inventory, quick. Hat? No. Uh, inventory. 
Uh, F. Here, quick, before we die. Am I warm? Oh, so close to death, peeps. I almost didn't even notice. Um, so anyway, let me just finish my thought really quickly here in the darkness. Um, are we Gamma 3? Gamma 4? That's what we're already on. Oh my gosh. So right over in this area, too, might not be a bad spot. I don't know. We want to build it somewhere where it's not close to a lot of metal nodes. So they will respawn. Maybe right along here would not be a bad spot. Cool. And I'm thinking probably just building it all out of... I mean, we could build that out of stone if we're in this area. There's tons of stone here. It would be really easy to get it all. All right. Under cover of darkness, we head back to the base. I feel like we need to add industrial grill to our to-do list. Or we could just build one right away. Why not just build one right away? We got it. We got the supplies. Let's do it. And we're back. The slowest trip ever. Over to slow mobility. I don't think this is gonna work out. I think we're gonna have to hop off. You better now that you don't have my fatty my fatty body on you. Uh let's just go like this. Maybe you could just come this way? Oh, much better. There we go. So just getting the stuff and things together to get the uh the grill online. I already got a bunch of the items that we need. Actually, I already have all the items that we need. So we can actually just squirt them right onto slow mobility. Like a so, like a so, like a so. And like so. Are you gonna land, home dog? Oh, you nailed it. Good job, buddy. We'll go like this, and then get right, right on. Kind of a little bit of a cheat that you can do that, don't you think? Just slightly, just a slight cheat. And then we should be able to, uh, can we just get into your inventory like that, buddy? Oh yeah. Like so and like so. Squirt all those guys on, structures cooking. Uh, turn it on. Let's make that industrial grill, yo. This is going to be a big help for if we kill any more alphas. It's going to allow us to get a huge amount of cooked prime meat right, right away. So I'm thinking we're going to squirt this right on him, too. Uh, why wouldn't we? Let's go ahead and just see right here. Oh, oh, stop listing. You're listing. Uh, let's go like this. And then... Are we hanging off the edge there? No, we're not. We're good. So we can probably move a little bit. This is really hard. There we go. We can probably move a little bit forward. Like so. Go to place. No, I thought you... No, wait. You could spin. Well, there was no spin. You did, there's, there's no spin. You go... To, wait, no. Get back on. You go to place, and then there's a spin. You place it, then you can spin it. I placed it. It just placed it. Why is there no spin? No, get back on. Well, there was no spin. So now it's off by a little bit. I'm not going to spend 300 metal to put it back on. Just to, we'll just go like this. No, even if you don't see the floor, line is still oh slow mobility. You're failing me, man. All right, so oh, I was trying to get on to gameplay in midair, but it didn't work out. All right, so we got our industrial grill. We were gonna put that on our to-do list, but we don't even need to do that now. So I'm thinking I gotta think of some. What are the next thing we gotta do? Hmm. Softus is happy. We have a couple new people on the server, by the way. A couple of friends of Corrales have joined us, and also um, TFC from Hermitcraft um, has joined us, uh, Tinfoil Chef, and XBCrafted has also joined us. So we got a bunch of more people on the server, by the way, and we'll probably be doing some collab stuff and things with some of those guys in the future. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see how up they are for that sort of stuff. But that should be pretty cool. Um, hello, Hot T-Rex action. What we'll level are you, little level 20 guy? I see you over there, too. Don't act like I don't level 48 all right so um i guess i think we're just gonna do be like an opportunistic hunter when it comes to the tames when we see stuff and things that we want to tame um while we're doing other things that's when we're gonna do our tames it's really hard to set out to do a tame um you never know what you're gonna find so in this instance i think that's what we'll do so i think we're gonna start gathering up materials for the mobile, or not the mobile, but the um, the mountain forge. I think I called it early in the episode a mountain base too, which it is not. It is a mountain forge area. So, oh, you want to go? Stupid bugs! I'm gonna start gathering up some of those materials and maybe probably making some stuff. I already have a bunch of stuff, and then I'll BRB these peeps. Yeah, and we're back. And there she is. Wait, what's happening to our? Oh, wait, six. 
Where are you? Where did you go, RG? No, you're not fighting something, are you? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta figure out which one of these is which. You're the big guy, right? Right up there? Why? Why? No. Wait. What? What? What is happening? Alright, there. We're out of the K menu. Alright, now we're back. And we're back, ladies and gentle peeps. And there is a level 108 Argentivus in front of us as we speak. There are some other RGs in the area. Let's see what we can do with this bad boy. No, land, four. We're going to try to grab a headshot off this guy straight away. No, don't, don't attack him. Don't bother. Get passed out. Come on, please. He's going to be hard to take down. I don't mind if he attacks gameplay a little bit. I can't believe he's not going to aggro, de-aggro onto me. He's already pretty hurt. How are you doing, gameplay? He's tanking it, man. He's not even taking damage. Get knocked out, RG. Get knocked out. One more attack. One more hit. He might go down. Come on, come on, come on. Get tired. Aren't you tired yet? Oh, oh, this is it. We can't hit him again. No way. We got to wait for the Topo to rise up. He's got to pass out. He's like near death. Come on, aren't you getting tired? Aren't you getting tired of attacking gameplay? You feel sleepy? You feel sleepy yet? I feel like you feel sleepy now. How are you doing gameplay? He's doing great. Oh, he's on me now. Crap. Crap, crap. Come on, are you feeling tired? He's down, he's down. All right, we got him down. 108, unconscious Argentivus right there. We're gonna be able to get this guy tamed up. I think we're just gonna use prime meat. Let's just take a look in the area and make sure there isn't anything aggressive around here. It doesn't look like there is. These mountain teams are always kind of super tough. Um. I don't have any extra meat or anything on me right now. I should be able to grab some prime off the RGs that are right over in this area. So I'm going to go ahead and get him tamed up. And then I'll be our beast, peeps. And we're back. Tonnage is the name of our new guy. There it is right there. Level 160 it tamed out at. That's pretty baller. Let's be honest. 1,400 health, 2,400 stamina. 500 weight to start with, 300% melee damage. Not bad. You're kind of your standard high level RG. So, and that's going to be our guy. Wait, no. We want you to follow us. Uh, we want you to follow us. This is going to be our guy simply for weight, for carrying stuff and things. Are you coming, buddy? Are you coming, Tonnage? We got to take him back to base and we got to. Oh, wait. We don't even have a cooking pot to make any dyes with to paint him. And then how are we going to paint him so he looks a lot? We got to paint him so he looks different. The, I don't know. We got to think of a good paint job. We might have to make a cooking pot up real quick. Where is our base at? Can't really see from here. But I'm excited about it, man. It's a really high level RG. Like, not like a perfect team or anything like that. But still, where is my base? There it is. This is our lead direction. He's going to be baller. I can't wait to see how high we can get his weight up. We're going to have to take him out. I'll take him out tonight off camera and just do some leveling up, probably. He's definitely slow. He's going to be kind of slower. So that's going to be a thing. But I think if we get him up to 1,000, like 1,200 weight, it's going to be pretty baller. So, all right. I'm going to bring go back to base here. I'm going to get a cooking pot made. And we're going to get some dye stuff and things going. And we're going to paint this guy. And we're back on tonnage. And there's a 40-something T-Rex over here I thought we would take out. I got him painted blue. And I and I, he kind of turned out kind of cool. He's kind of blue and pink. He's blink or plue. I'm not sure which one. Pluish. Blinkish. Blinkish? That sounds kind of amazing. I want a Blinkish Dino. And his attack, melee, or his melee damage is really, really low. So it's taken forever to kill this thing. Come on, man. Die. You can do it. I believe in you. We killed a level 48 T-Rex. Unbelievable. 
All right, let's turn some gammas up so you can see a little bit better. It's getting to be nighttime. But this is what he ended up turning out like. Oh, he's got his blue blood. He's blue blooded. So I figured he just wouldn't do any other colors on him. He kind of just turned out neat the way he looks with the blue. I like it very much. All right, so um, we did get a couple of levels here. Let's let's go over here and land. Come here. Come on. Let's land, homie. You like landing. Uh, and let's take a look. First pump of weight. 20 points? 21. 600 weight already. So we're doing really good already at 600 weight. And I like the way he looks like I just like the way he looks just like this. I think it's kind of neat. I like his he's got little eye colors already. It's pretty cool for sure. I also repainted Hungry. Um, they changed the way that the wolves work and you can paint their 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 fur now and you couldn't before. So I went ahead and painted Hungry up a little bit differently and I think it looks pretty rad. We got to put a slip gator symbol on his butt though. So um and what else did I want to show you guys? I think no, that was it. We got another level on um, on Bloodwing, but I ended up pumping, and I have been pumping melee damage on him. I want to get him up to 1,000. Some of these guys I'm not really taking around and doing anything with because I'm just kind of letting them level up on their own as uh, they naturally do in the world. And that's probably what we'll do with Tonnage, too. We'll just kind of let him uh, level up in the world and do his thing and just kind of be sitting here being a bird, getting some levels before we actually take him out to do stuff. He is pretty powerful, though. You know he is, man. We already took out a level 48 T-Rex with him, so straight away, he's, you know, he's nothing, nothing. He's not, he's, he's better than the mouse on a wheel. That's what I'm trying to say. He's just better than the mouse on a wheel. So, all right, really excited. We got, we got some good stuff done today, peeps. We got the fabricator built. I got an armor replaced. We got the Toto list up there. We got our new bird. It's been a good day. And so that's going to be all for today, ladies and gentle peeps. I hope that you had fun hanging out. I know that I did. If you guys like the video, please don't forget to hit the like button and show your support. <laughs> Feel free to share and favorite the videos you see fit. May the stuff and things be with you. Man, I got to find that mayonnaise jar, Angram. <laughs>